Now, WGAL News 8's Weather on the 8s with meteorologist Christine Ferreira. Good morning, happy 4th of July, it is 618. Now tonight, mainly dry is the call for fireworks. I can't rule out an isolated thunderstorm still lingering, but I think most spots are going to be dry. Temperatures will be around 84 degrees, about 9, 10 o'clock. Now a cold front is going to arrive on Friday. This is going to be the temperature and humidity relief we've been looking for all week. So happy to report this news, a pleasant weekend is ahead. So we're talking about temperatures this weekend in the low 80s with low humidity. Today, pretty uh, stifling still. We have partly sunny skies in store for you. Partly sunny through the afternoon with a few showers or thunderstorms popping up toward evening. Hot and humid. Highs will be near 90. Feel like temperatures just shy of 100. Tonight, partly cloudy and isolated thunder showers still may be lingering. Warm, muggy, you know the drill. Temperatures in the 70s. And tomorrow, partly sunny with a couple of showers around. I think it will still be warm and humid and we could approach that 90 mark tomorrow. We'll see if we get there, but today will be day five of our 90 degree heat. Right now in Hershey, it's 76 degrees. Dew point 69, not too bad. When you see dew points reaching the low to mid 70s like they have been, that's when the humidity gets oppressive and really steamy, and that's what we should see again this afternoon. Right now in Gettysburg, it's 75 degrees. We have 76 in Carlisle, 74 for Sealands Grove, 71 in York County. Today's weather and health report, our UV index still quite high with a burn time of 15 to 25 minutes. Air quality moderate, mold levels are high and the pollen levels are low. Live on Super Doppler 8, no storms just yet, but there could be a few that try to pop up this afternoon. We have the stalled boundary right across the I-80 corridor and it will provide the focus for a few more showers and thunderstorms later today. You see them right there on the predictor. Now, once we hit this evening, those thunderstorms fizzle quickly, but I won't rule out just a stray one hanging around for fireworks. I think most spots, though, are dry, and tomorrow, just a couple of passing showers or isolated thunderstorms. How about Friday? Here's this well-advertised cold front sweeping through during midday with scattered showers and storms. Behind it, if you have Friday evening plans, I think you're going to notice the lower humidity right away. It will trickle in very fast. It's going to feel quite nice. Uh, your bay forecast for today in the next couple of days shows temperatures cooling off just slightly. Instead of 90s, we're seeing mid to upper 80s. Thunderstorms possible on Friday. Beach forecast, also some storms on Friday as that cold front comes through more toward Friday evening there at the beaches. Saturday, Sunday, if you're thinking about the beach this weekend or into next week, it looks great. Back home, one more 90 degree day in there. Eh, we could brush 90 tomorrow in a few spots, but by Friday we're cooling off and then I don't see a return to the 90 degree heat through the rest of the seven day. All okay. right. Isn't that music to your ears? <laughs> well, it's a little, little bit, bit of a break, break from the oppressive heat we've seen, no doubt. Right, no warnings, <laughs> no uh, advisories today. A lot right. of people will appreciate that. Yes. All right, Christine, thank you.